It's a nice Tuesday afternoon, Marty. Yeah, and it's going to be a nice Wednesday. It's going to be a nice Thursday. It's going to be a nice Friday. And I was having this conversation with meteorologist Abigail Degler uh, before I came on the air. She was leaving. I was coming in. Saturday may be trending a little bit more toward the good, but it isn't changing the Sunday and Monday forecast, which are now trending maybe a little bit further away from the good. Good afternoon, everyone. We'll talk about that in just a second. Right now on TV Hill, it is 72 degrees. There's a humidity Lynn and I are talking about. What this time you have to say it was 25, 27%, 48% humidity. It's still not that, you know, real close, uncomfortable August feel. But you'll notice it when you walk out the door if you've just getting up from third shift and have not been out yet with your coffee. You'll, you'll feel it. It's not uncomfortable. Uh, Brahmer's at 3029, a bit of an easterly flow set up at 13, and that's, that's a rather big deal. Uh, we are going to see some cloud. When we say easterly flow, Delaware Bay, Chesapeake Bay, Atlantic Ocean, you're bringing in air coming off of an ocean and two rather significant bodies of water. So that, that tends to bring some clouds inland, which will happen. Uh, 73 right now in Westminster, 71 Bel Air, a little bay effect, 67 in Annapolis, 70 College Park. Eastern right now at 70, 72 degrees in Cumberland. But take a look. It's actually because of the haze and a few of these high clouds meandering in from the east. A little bit cooler, getting a bit of an umbrella effect than this time yesterday. But it, all in all, it, it's pretty pleasant. High temperatures today around the area, 76,000, 76 in Perry Hall. Uh, Columbia, 76, 75, Ellicott City. Look at this, uh, 77 in, uh, in uh, Sykesville, uh, Eldersburg, and up in Finksburg, 76, Aberdeen, Abingdon, 76 degrees in Joppa Town. All right, so here's the deal. Here's the visible satellite photo. And here you can see this easterly flow, and here's this haze hanging over the area. What we want to do now, though, is show you some headlines. We know it's cool and comfortable today, pleasant and comfortable, however you want to phrase it, seasonal. More nice weather is on the way as we move toward the weekend, primarily Friday and potentially Saturday. We're keeping our fingers crossed on that. But still, we are eyeing rain chances for Memorial Day weekend, and the weekend forecast remains uncertain. I said this yesterday. I'll say it again. I work here. I do the weather for you. I present it to you at noon. I, in my personal life, will be keeping my eye on this and watching this forecast as we move through the next many years. I mean, take a look. Futurecast just shows a few clouds meandering around the area as we move through the day, as we move through the night. And as we get into tomorrow, there's really not a whole lot of shaking going on. There, even with that easterly flow, there's just not. It's just going to be varying amounts of cloud cover. What we're talking about is an event that's still many days away. I showed it to you. It's gathering moisture down to the south. It's miles away and days away, but nonetheless, it's a clear and present fact on the sat red photo. Mostly cloudy, 76 degrees is going to be your high this day. Overnight tonight, we'll make it partly cloudy and 51. 78 is now your average daytime high. 81 tomorrow, a little bit more humid with this easterly flow. 73 Thursday, Friday 74. We start the weekend off on a real, real good foot. But then Saturday, we're going to say mostly cloudy. This can meander. We're hoping it meanders back in our favor. Right now, we're really eyeing Sunday and Monday, 78 and 84 degrees. Back to you.